Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are actually gonna be unbagging our Ipsy Glam Bag Plus and our regular, regular Ipsy bag. Now these actually came the same exact day. That's fine. Uh, I just kind of wanted to combine these uh, together because I actually have do have a couple unboxings I wanna do. I wanted um, the Jeffree Star that I did, the Boxy Charms that I'm doing, and the Ipsy's, and I just kind of feel like there's just too many boxes to all do separate videos. You feel like you guys would kind of be sick of those if I did those back to back. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and throw these two together. So we're gonna go ahead and start with the regular Ipsy bag for the month of July. Okay, so this says Say Golden. Very chic, I like it. Oh, look at the tab, that's super, super cute. So it has like a little sun tab uh, with a little blue gem in the middle because it has like blue lining inside. Oh, I like this bag, it's very cute. Love it, okay. And right away, oh, I'm so happy. Okay, so I got a Koki Precise Longwear Liquid Eyeliner. Now I actually have what, one or two Koki products? I know I definitely have a highlighter from them that I love. Uh, I have the Koki, like, little beauty sponge that was really nice, and I don't see any Koki products in my area at all at any drugstore or anything, so uh, I can't just go, like, buy one. I know I can order online. I just hate paying for shipping. So I really like the fact that they put cookie products in my Ipsy bags. So it lets me test out new products from a brand that I actually enjoy. So this is the tip right here. I really enjoy that. And, oh, very nice and precise. You could definitely do it like a little line with that because I don't like big, thick eyeliner on me anyway because I have hooded eyes and it kind of makes it look smaller. Um, nice. Not really too much of a, sm a smudge. Little tiny bit, but nothing crazy. So, yeah. I'm excited for that one. Okay, the next item we have is from Araceli. This looks to be like the little eyeshadow quads that they do. Um, the packaging is cute. You probably can't tell, but it has like a little thing on the side of it but the black and gold is really nice yeah this is just like a little duo shadow um, piece and I am not gonna keep this because I definitely have these in my collection somewhere these exact colors I'm very sure of it because I do have quite an extensive collection so I'm going to set this aside for a future giveaway the next item we have is from pure lease this is the watermelon charcoal purifying cleanser I'm actually also going to set this aside for a future giveaway. Um, this. Oh, yes. Okay. I love the brand. Wait, I hope that's how you say it. The That one right there. <laughs> um, I've actually tried some of their hair products before. Uh, their leave-in conditioner is amazing. Me and my daughter both use that. So super excited that this is in here. This is the scalp and body scrub. Nice. so freaking good oh my gosh I cannot wait to take a shower with this this is definitely gonna be a body scrub it says it's a scalp scrub too hmm I've never scrubbed anything on scalp before oh, that smells so good I want a whole bottle of this all right it says scrub the drama out of your life and scalp uh, this blend of sugar coconut oil and probiotics cuts through to be to cleanse your hair and body while calming the crazy. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Okay, this smells amazing. I'm going to test this out today. Um, so I'm very excited for that. I think that and the liner, I'm happy with this bag. <laughs> All right, the next item we have is from uh, Derm Derm Dermedicine. Uh, this is a retinol detox mask formulated with naturally derived ingredients. So it says to smooth over clean skin, avoid eyes, leave for 10-15 minutes in a relaxed position to let dry. Remove with damp cloth. 
nice. Um, I might put this in a giveaway. I just do, I have a lot of like face masks and sheet masks and all these other stuff that I am kind of behind on trying and I really need to get through them. So I might just put this in a giveaway. I'm just going to set this aside and I will think about that one. But that is it. I think that this little Ipsy bag is definitely a winner. Um, I'm really, really happy with the products that I got, especially the, the Whey product and the liner. So I would say that the Ipsy bag this month is definitely a win. So we're going to go ahead and move on to our Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, and hopefully it will be as good what in the world um, as the regular Ipsy. Okay, so right away I see something outside of the bag, and it is all kinds of smashed up. <laughs> the box did not survive. So this is a Beach Mist Botanical After Sun Spray. Okay. Shake gently before use and spray onto face or desired area of the body. Hmm. Interesting. All right, so this is what it looks like. I don't know if I've ever heard of like an after sun spray, except for like aloe spray and stuff like that, for like sunburns. But we are gonna spray this inside the box and see what it smells like. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know exactly what it's supposed to do. Just like refresh. Uh, if you guys have this or have heard of this and know exactly what it does, leave me a comment down below. Um, because the smell, is, the smell is not that pleasing. So, uh, moving on. This is the bag for the month of July. Uh, it says stay golden as well. And it's got the little sun. Uh, with the blue diamond eye. Is that what that was in the little one? No, okay. <laughs> I thought I had missed that. That one's just a, like a little gem. This one is actually an eye. So that's still really, really cute. And the first product I see is a palette. Nice. Everybody knows if you've been with me for a little while, I love eyeshadow palettes. They are my favorite. So this is called Golden Hour. Perfect for the theme uh, by Beauty For Real. A mango butter eyeshadow palette. That sounds really nice. I like the fact that it looks like water with the sunset on it. That's really pretty. And, hmm. I don't know if that is what I expected. So you definitely have Sorry, let me take this little plastic off. Okay, so there are, there's the shades right there. You got like a purple, purple, blue, gold, and like this copper color, which I get it, it's colors of like sunrise and sunset, but it's still a really pretty palette. Um, I like the names. So you have like Reflection, Solstice, Ablaze, Golden Ray, Horizon, Infinite, Shadow, and Pink Sands. So. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to give this a try and we'll see what I think. The next item we have is from Complex Culture. This is the Rose Quartz, uh, one of those sculpting stone things. So this is it right here. It's like a stone and I guess it's supposed to help like blood flow and things like that. I don't even know how to pronounce it, you guys. G-U-A-S-H-A. -S so it's an, an ancient beauty ritual to help tone facial contours, uh, reduce puffiness, and relieve mus muscle tension for the appearance of smoother, radiant looking skin. When combined with natural skin nourishing properties of rose quartz, uh, the sculpting stone gives the ultimate at home facial massage. So it says, uh, first apply a serum or an oil to help guide the stone across the clean, dry skin. So I have, I definitely have like some oils I could do and I think you're supposed to go like up and it's supposed to, yeah. Hmm. I've never used one of these before. Um, but I'm definitely curious. It's a, heavier than I thought it would be. Uh, start at the neck here and travel upwards to the jawline, okay? 
over lips and cheeks, brow and forehead, followed by drinking plenty of water to aid flushing out toxins and hydrating skin from within. Nice. And I think it has a and it has a tutorial at complexculturebeauty.com. That's really cool. And the fact that it comes like with like a little pouch to keep it in so it doesn't get like all dirty and stuff. Um I would say this is actually kind of cool. Uh, yeah, it feels really nice. Um, I, I, I kind of touched it just a little bit on my skin, but it feels really nice. And I'm going to watch the tutorial and I think I'm going to give this a shot. The next item we have is from Dr. Brandt. Yes, I love Dr. Brandt. Uh, this is the Pores No More Pore Purifying Cleanser. I actually have a lot of pores on my nose and like right in here. So they've been bugging me lately. This has definitely come at such a good time. Very happy that this is in here. And the last item we have is, yay, I'm so excited. Okay, these are Tarte Lashes. This is the, which one? The Goddess Lashes. I've actually always wanted to try uh, Tarte Lashes. Sorry for all the glare. Um, but I don't know, I haven't bought them because they're kind of pricey but they're really, really pretty and I cannot wait to do a look and use these. So that makes me happy. All right, so let's recap on the Ipsy Plus. So we got the palette that is really, really pretty. We got the little beauty tool, which actually is a very different, something I'm interested in, really excited for. We have the Tarte Lashes. I love lashes and I love trying new lashes, so that makes me happy. We have the Dr. Brandt uh, Pore Purifying Cleanser, which is something I needed and really excited for. And we have the After Sun Beach Spray, which, you know, even if it doesn't end up working out, I still think I scored pretty good on this bag. All right, guys, so that's it for this unbagging. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a big ol' thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe because I have a beauty unboxing next week that involves uh, a giveaway of the Jeffree Star Star Ranch palette, and that one's going to be really fun. So, uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.